Our topic today is on a perspective overview of microbial fuel cells. If you are new here, welcome. We are a group of retired professors behind Team Biotech Whisperer channel sharing bite-sized videos in life sciences. Let's dive into the topic for today. Introduction Microbial fuel cells, MFCs, are a type of bioelectrochemical system that converts chemical energy from organic or inorganic matter into electrical energy. These devices are based on the conversion of organic matter by microorganisms, which generate electricity as a byproduct of their metabolism. The potential of MFCs to generate electricity from waste materials and their ability to treat wastewater simultaneously make them an attractive technology for a wide range of applications. Current Perspectives Microbial fuel cells, MFCs, were once considered just a scientific curiosity, but recent research has revealed they can have multiple applications. MFCs can generate energy from waste without the need for external energy inputs, making them useful for remote power generation and robotics. Additionally, MFCs can capture microbial responses and metabolism to produce an electrical signal, giving the technology inherent sensing capabilities. The use of ceramic materials and ion exchange membranes also has the potential to improve sanitation in developing countries. While MFCs are still considered a new technology, continued research may lead to solutions for global environmental issues and play a role in the future for future generations. It is up to us to make it happen. Types of microbial fuel cells MFCs can be divided into two main categories, air cathode and oxygen reducing cathode. Air cathode MFCs use oxygen from the air as the electron acceptor at the cathode, whereas oxygen reducing cathode MFCs use an oxygen reducing cathode. Additionally, MFCs can be classified according to the type of microbial population they use. Mixed culture MFCs use a diverse microbial population, while pure culture MFCs use a single microbial species. Advantages and challenges MFCs have several advantages over traditional power generation methods. For example, they have a high energy conversion efficiency, they use waste materials as fuel, and they can be used to treat wastewater simultaneously. However, there are also significant challenges facing the development and implementation of MFCs. For example, the power output of MFCs is currently low, and the cost of materials can be high. Additionally, the durability and longevity of MFCs is an area that requires further research and development. Current Applications and Future Directions MFCs have a wide range of potential applications, including wastewater treatment, remote power generation, and the treatment of industrial waste streams. In addition to these applications, MFCs are being researched for use in the production of biofuels and the treatment of agricultural waste. The future of MFC research and development is focused on increasing power output, improving durability and longevity, and reducing the cost of materials. Conclusion Microbial fuel cells are an exciting technology that has the potential to generate electricity from waste materials and treat wastewater simultaneously. There are several types of MFCs, each with their own advantages and challenges.